afternoon everyone. Monday, new start to the week. Very exciting stuff happening here. We're just chilling. Hey Trixie. You're so cute when you're looking outside. Just looking through that little hole out there. All you see is a bit of a face just looking out. Going, Who is that? We should do some training tonight, eh? What should we try and teach you? Eh? Got any tricks you want us to train Trixie? I don't know what else is there. Obviously it's like rollover. I'd love to teach her bang bang, like the play dead. That'd be that'd be fun, but I don't know how you do that. I'll look up online and maybe we'll give it a try later. Lauren's out tonight, so it's just me and the kids. Kids as in animals. Finish off the ironing from last night. Exciting life at the moment. Winter, but it's still still in a t-shirt. It's not bad. Oh, hello everyone. Um, I have just got home. Basically, I'm rushing out again. Monday nights is always a bit of a, a rush. Um, I always feel so stressed. Even now I'm stressed because I feel like I'm not going to get there early, which to me is not on time. And because I know there's going to be traffic and I don't want to have to sit in traffic and ugh. Today was an extremely confrontational day in the jury. We listened to and saw a lot of pretty gruesome and confrontational stuff. Even though you try and think of it as like a TV show or something that's not real, you know it's real, you know it happened, so that makes it even harder to listen to. And you've already gone through like all of this storyline and all of this sort of stuff. It just makes everything so real. Seeing it like that is just very in your face and it, it affects you. It's not going to not affect you. I'm feeling a little bit shaky about all of that. I also don't feel very well, so I'm just very lethargic and very... I'm not shaky, but I'm a bit like, I don't know, I just feel off. Anyway, I'm off to an appointment and then I will be home and I will be going to bed pretty much straight away because I am so tired. Look at that moon, that giant, oh, it's disappeared. There it is. That giant yellow, like, I don't know, dot in the sky over there. Oh, it's gone blurry. Oh, that sucks. There we go. That giant dot over there, over the mountains, is the moon. And it's dinner time. My back's been pretty sore today, and I was like, oh, what have I done to hurt my back? It wasn't too, I was just out before, digging in the garden again. And when I was shoveling, each time I went to lift, it hurt. So I must have been doing something wrong yesterday, or just doing too much, so. We got some bacon and eggs, some mushrooms, some tomatoes, some cheese, avocado, wraps and some hot chili. That's kind of my go-to meal when I can't be, can't be bothered cooking. I was very tempted to just get something easy in the way home, but no, nah, we're on a budget. I make use of what we got in the house. What'd you find? What'd you find over there? Who's a pretty girl? Who's a pretty girl? You are, yeah, you are a good girl. You are a pretty girl. And who's a pretty boy, Max? Hey, Max. Yay, Max. And blah. Dinner time. Max. 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 You wanna eat? You wanna eat, boy? What have you got on your nose? Give me that. What is that? A booger? Ugh. Look who's home, Trixie. Mummy's home. And a nice little cuddle? Yeah. Good girl. Mummy. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> They're so cute. What are you doing? Get out of the house. Big paw. Little face. Big cuddles. Is that the baby? Yeah. Chickly likes the cuddles. Mm, you get him. Like, and he must <laughs> really like it. He good girl. So cute. I love it. <laughs> She's good at cuddling. Mm. We're so lucky how much she loves to cuddle. Mm. That's what we love to do, as you can see. <laughs> yeah, we don't hate it. <laughs> yeah, we're big cuddlers. Like, it's time for a cuddle and time not for, but I think it's why she goes a bit crazy when we're both on our computers and then she's like, I want to cuddle. 
She's going to stop barking any second. Why? Oh, she can see the reflection. Yeah. Don't tease her. <laughs> Speak. Look at the camera like, why are you filming me? <laughs> I'm trying to sleep here. This is being cute. Yeah. Smush face. Mm. Very smush face. Alrighty, so I'm home. I'm very, 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 very tired. It has been a long day, full on day, and I'm ready for bed. I actually have an early start tomorrow. I have to get in there a bit earlier, but I think we're finishing a little bit earlier, so that works out well. Dixie's ready for bed. Aren't ya? I was actually just watching the first video clip of her in it when we, when I went to see her at the RSPCA for the first time. She was so tiny, so little. Her face was so tiny and her little legs were all stumpy. Oh, it was cute. We're going to end the vlog. Question of the day comes from Chris. So thank you, Chris. And that is, if you could invent anything, what would it be? Can I go first? Um, uh, teleportation device. You can't steal mine. <laughs> Come back to me. Okay. Well, mine is a teleportation device. Um, whether or not it's actually scientifically plausible is regardless. And you could literally just step into something and you would be somewhere immediately. No travel, no worries, no anything. Particularly, I think this would work if you have, like, long distance relationships or family that live interstate or overseas and you felt like seeing them, you could be like, oh, let's have a dinner date. I'll be there in like one minute. Bang, teleportation device. You got it yet? No, I think teleportation trumps everything. That's true. Mine would have to be environmental, invent clean energy. <laughs> okay. Well, make it more common. Or to yeah. grow like vegetables and stuff. That's not really environmentally friendly. You know how they mass grow vegetables and stuff like that? And yeah. use chemicals and all that sort of stuff? Yeah. If they don't use chemicals, they just have massive greenhouses with solar panels. The solar panels are for, are for energy. That's how plants get their energy, through the sun. Did you yeah. not do, like, seventh grade science? Yeah. What's it called? Photosynthesis. Yeah, oh, good job. Yeah! <laughs> Nothing to do with photography. Yeah. Like I first thought. <laughs> so let us know in the comments below what you would invent if you could invent something. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. Good morning, afternoon or night, whatever it is where you are. And I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Bye. He'll see you too. Bye-bees. And she'll see you too. Even though she's asleep. Bye. We're over here. We run all that way. I'm going to be very disappointed in you. Oh, 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 oh. I just walked into a spider web. Oh my god, ew.